Thank you to Helix for sponsoring today's video. Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me again today. Today, we are gonna be checking out E.T. the Extraterrestrial from 1982. And I know this one is an all-time classic, must see. My sister and I didn't really watch a lot of alien movies as children because she was very afraid of aliens. So we skipped a lot of those sci-fis that everybody has seen. So I'm really happy to catch up on them now. Before we get started, I wanted to take a quick moment to thank the sponsor of today's video Helix. You guys know that I only work with sponsors that I feel can bring you something really useful and I feel like everybody can benefit from improving their sleep. Helix Sleep makes premium mattresses and bedding that are customized to fit your needs and they're conveniently shipped right to your door. Right from the very first night I slept on my Helix mattress, I noticed a huge difference in my comfort and quality of sleep. I don't toss and turn all night anymore, my joints don't hurt from sleeping on my side, and I wake up feeling completely refreshed. And the cool thing about Helix is you can customize your mattress even if you have two sleepers in the same bed. So my partner is a back sleeper, I'm a side and stomach sleeper. We both took the sleep quiz together and they matched a mattress that was perfect for both of us. They made the sleep quiz to match your unique body type and sleep preferences to the perfect mattress for you. My partner and I took the sleep quiz and we were matched with the Helix Midnight Lux, which is designed with a medium feel top of the bed, not too firm and not too soft. It's the perfect firmness and my back and joints are completely supported and it really has improved my quality of sleep. And it was amazing to have it delivered right to my door. It comes rolled up in a box and it's super easy to set up yourself or with some animal friends if you have them. All right, Bossy's gonna help me set this up. With your Helix sleep mattress, you get a 100 night sleep trial, along with a 10 year warranty. And there are financing options and flexible payment plans. And if it makes you nervous to buy something you haven't tried, you get more than three months to make sure that you love it. And if you don't, they'll pick it up for you and you'll get a full refund. We also upgraded to the Glaciotex cooling cover, which is a great way to keep cool during these hot summer months. I really love my Helix mattress, and I think you would too. If you're looking for a new bed, check out Helix. Click on the link below or go to helixsleep.com slash jenmurray for up to $200 off your Helix sleep mattress, plus two free pillows, and the pillows are amazing. Thank you again to Helix for sponsoring today's video, and thank you to you guys for checking out Helix. And now, let's watch a movie. Let's get to it, I'm really excited. Here we go, E.T. All right, guys, I'm very, very excited. I have an awesome editor, as you guys may or may not know, Steph G, and I've heard that this is one of her faves from childhood, so looking forward to it. E.T. Drew Barrymore. Yes, okay, I heard she's like very, very young in it, though. Music by John Williams. Oh my gosh, okay, so it's going to be amazing. We know that. I think I will declare John Williams my favorite movie composer of all time. Spielberg. Oh wow, is that a spaceship? Right out of the gate. And is he aliens? Oh, creepy fingers. Are we on the ship now? Oh, they're all glowy. Show me the aliens. Are they just walking into the city? They're frightened of humans. I like this music. Oh, I feel bad for him. What is that, like their heart? Are they hunting him? They're chasing him. Little sounds that he's making. <laughs> They're closing up the door. They left him. I hope these guys don't catch him. Close encounter. They left him. Leave him alone. I don't feel like these guys are here to help. Maybe they are. Got an arrow right in your chest. They play in D&D. How that fell over the pizza man? I'm ready to play now, you guys! He's so little, huh? Mike, 
You Mama. have to ask Steve, he's game master. Uh -huh. Go away for the pizza first. Then I'm in. Yeah, you're in. You're gonna let him play? Okay, good. I do love board games. And I love pizza. Why do I feel like this kid's gonna drop that pizza? Harvey, is that you, boy? Yeah, that's the one you asked. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the little alien? Yeah, he's in there. We left the pizza right. in the yard. Where's the pizza? It's in the pool shop. It's throwing the ball at me. Nobody go out there. <laughs> yeah, right, kid. <laughs> there's nothing in here. The gate's open. I think there's something in there. Are those his little feet? Beauty's come back again, Mom. Everybody back inside, yeah. Nice one, Elliot. It was an accident. In the house. My right? mom, it was... They just left the pizza in the yard. Aww. He's little. A dog. A dog. So creepy in that yard at night. Don't go into the... Whatever that is, like wheat, corn. Don't go into the cornfield. You're crazy. Is this gonna be spooky? I'm nervous. Look at his little feet. I hope he's a nice alien. Sounds like a little piglet. Oh, 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 oh. That was kind of freaky. Well, you're both afraid of each other. You should just make friends. Leaving a trail of candy for him. Is this one of the guys? Nothing like an adventure with a bike and a backpack. He's there, he's in the trees. I don't want these men to catch that little alien. I think he's nice. What are you going at? That little Drew? Oh my gosh, she's so small. Well, it was real, I swear. What are you going in? How? <laughs> uh, maybe it was an iguana. It was no iguana. I couldn't have imagined it. A deformed kid or something. A deformed kid. It was nothing like that! Penis breath! Elliot! <laughs> the mom's like, that's hilarious, but you can't say it. Dad would believe me. Oh, maybe where's you their call dad? Your father and tell him about it. He's in Mexico with Sally. He must have left them. Where's Mexico? Oh, poor mom. I'm gonna kill. If you ever see it again, call me and we'll have somebody come and take it away. They'll give it a lobotomy or do experiments. Yeah, I agree. It's Mexico. Grow up. Think how other people feel for a change. Oh, the dad must have left pretty recently. Maybe not, but she's still upset about it. Hmm. Can you hear the little footsteps shuffling around? He's there, he's there. Oh. Huh? Can't even talk. I'd probably be the same. I'd, I would be speechless. Michael. <gasps> He's like a little, uh, a little, I don't know. Is that the candy? I brought it back. Is he bringing him inside? It sounds like a cat. <laughs> Loves candy. This alien and I would get along very well. <laughs> he's making a mess! Well, he's got himself a little pet alien now. I wonder if he can talk, or if he will be able to talk. He's doing what the kid's doing! This is too cute. <laughs> They're going to be best friends. Is he lulling him to sleep with his purr? Are these guys still going to be hunting him? I guess, yeah. Don't find any footsteps. Candy, candy. I probably wouldn't eat anything I just found on the ground in the forest after an alien ship was there. 
Okay, you're hot. Little cheater. Where's the little alien? I thought he was in his bedroom. Didn't run over him, did he? Oh. Yeah, I thought he was in there too. Okay. No TV. Yeah, right. Come on. Okay, he's still in there. Come on. Come on. The little noises are very adorable. Do you talk? Does he? Me? Elliot. Elliot. These are feet. toys. Rito. <laughs> and <laughs> This is adorable. This is a, an alien learning about the world from a child is so cute. This is all important and stuff. Comes out and you can eat it. We, this is what we get around in. Car. Don't eat it. Hey. Hey. Are you hungry? I think he's always hungry. Yeah, the dog would not like that. Mm. I like this. this. This kid is too cute. Just friggin' him everything. Come here. Is he gonna tell I'm him? Feeling faker. I've got something really you know, important said to tell you. Got 69, Remember the goblin? You're so lame. He came back. He came back? Oh my god! <laughs> I have absolute power. Is it the coyote? No, I swear it. The most excellent promise. The most excellent, yes. I swear. You might scare him. Let's close your eyes. I'm surprised he's showing his brother. I have absolute, have absolute power. That was a good Yoda. Mm. The kid's gonna see it too. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, this couldn't have gone worse. What happened in here? You need my room. This is an accident. Let's <laughs> guys keep an eye on Gertie for me while I take a shower. Hello. She's just like, I don't know. Clean it. Put the shelves back up, I guess, even though you're a child. I'm keeping him. You can't tell. Not even mom. Grown-ups can't see him. Only little kids. Give me a break. <laughs> no, what's going to happen? Do it, Mike. <laughs> You promise? Well, good, okay. I'm gonna keep this secret. Now what, though? He just lives in his closet forever? It's the same guy with the keys. Are they gonna be able to track him all the way to Elliot's house? The dog. Something is up in there. Maybe he's some animal. He's he a plant. Is he a pig? He sure eats like one. Kind of sounds like one, too. Okay. We're here. Where are you from? Um, just pointing to the sky. I don't like his feet. I don't really like his feet either, but he's very sweet, I think. He's trying to tell us something. Earth. Is he going to tell them where he's from? Where are you from, little man? What's he doing? What's he doing? What is he doing? What's happening? <laughs> oh, oh my god, he can love to stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's freaky. What other powers does he have, I wonder? He's learning his ABCs. <gasps> he can. Oh! Wow, okay. He's like magical. Did you explain school to him? How do you explain school to higher intelligence? So we don't wake up on Mars and surrounded by millions of these little squashy guys. He's kind of squashy. <laughs> Where's your goblin? Shut up. He's a spaceman. Oh. Oh. Where's he from? Uranus? Get it? Uranus? <laughs> he doesn't get it. Oh my god, these kids. <laughs> I would hate to be that bus driver. Oh no. Although she seems nice. <laughs> Great job, man. I'm very impressed with that. Doing the actual frog dissection. They seem pretty young to be dissecting a frog, no? I wonder what these aliens came to Earth for, just to look around, see what's up. Are they gonna make friends? I wonder what my dog would think of him. 
What's he gonna get up to in this house by himself, wearing flannel? The dog likes him now, now that he can open the fridge. Yeah, No good. Only candy. I agree, potato salad's gross. Is he gonna get drunk? Started with the dissection. <laughs> thing that you should be looking for. Is he like connected to him? Whatever this alien guy is doing, the kid is feeling. How are they connected? First of all, He's super drunk. Yeah. Oh man. They just have chloroform cotton balls in their class. That's crazy. You don't want to watch them, you don't have to. I don't really want him to kill him though. Hmm. Long distance from California? This call is expensive. Without an operator, I can hold for five minutes. Let me talk to that. Hello, Mr. <laughs> Goodbye. What is he gonna get up to? He's making a plan here of some kind, or he's figuring something out. Yeah, save him, save him! Good for him! Yes! I'm so proud of him. <laughs> I was just thinking how short he was. He kissed her. Set them free! He made such a mess in there. What is the mom gonna say? Oh, he's drunk. Here he is. Just as soon as I unload the stuff. She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Is she gonna notice him or not? Baskin. Intoxicated. He set all the frogs free. Be. He said B. He said B. You should be good. Be good. He can talk. I have goosebumps. He can talk. I'll be right back in 10 minutes. Stay oh, there. you should bring that kid with you, though. Bum. He's learning to talk. You want to call somebody? Don't tell anybody. Does she have him in, his, in her room now? Be good. <laughs> <laughs> God! Oh. What? Yeah. He said it. I taught him how to talk, though. E.T., can you say that? E.T. 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 The most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. He's got bracelets on. Oh. He said bone. Home. That's E.T.'s home. <laughs> E.T. Home. Home. E.T. Phone home. Phone home. Wants to call home. E.T. Oh my god, he's mm -hmm. talking. E.T. Phone home. I have chills. I've heard that forever. And they'll come. Come. They'll come get home. him. He wants to go home. Poor baby. Oh, they're driving by listening to everybody. I see. Just grab anything looks like he can make a machine. No, 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 now. shush. You have absolute power, remember? He does have absolute power. He doesn't look too good. We're fine. How, what's all this weird? They are stuff? connected. Look, he's fine. He's Dad, sick. Shoot. Remember when he used to take us out? We'll do that again, Elliot. Wendy and the boys captured by the pirates. He did that. He leaves first at his day. Is he listening to the story? Ouch. It was poison. Oh. my life. Oh. Can he heal him? She oh, she could he's so well. nice. Do you believe in fairies? I do, I do, I do. If you believe I believe in fairies. Mm. Oh, he looks very distinguished. Listen how he's breathing. He's feeling everything. He's feeling everything. Uh-oh. Is he dying? Oh my, a phone to phone home. You're going as a ghost. Now you know the plans by heart. Meet you at the lookout. I'm not stupid, you know. Ready? Ready. Ready. I love this little guy. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no! 
Be cool, E.T. No, you don't have to heal him. No, no, no. Aww. Be cool, E.T. Does he get it? Thank you. Thank you. This mom is oblivious. Dirty. Come here. Come on. So what are they going to the lookout for? We're taking him up somewhere tall so we can phone home. Just waddling around. Uh, it must be very confusing for him, an alien on Halloween. Is that Yoda? That's a good Yoda. Ah, oh, that kind of looks like him. Where's he taking him? Is E.T. driving the bike now? They're flying! Cute! They're flying! Yeah, nice soft landing. That was so sweet! Alright, I wonder if this is gonna work. She's pissed. Mexico. Are these the guys? Oh no. Look how many guys. Come on, E.T., phone home. E.T., it's working. Yeah. Oh. He wants to go home. That's so sweet. What are these freaking guys gonna find in here? We have to go now, E.T. <laughs> He's getting sick. We have to go home now. Mm -hmm. You should give him some time. Oh. Aww. He hurts. We could be happy here. We could grow up together, E.T. Poor kid. They slept there? Uh-oh, his mom's gonna be pissed. Well, she'll be worried. Where's E.T.? E.T.? Uh, how was he dressed when last seen? Hunchback. Are the other kids gonna spill the beans because they're worried about him? Oh, he looks bad. Don't ever do this again, Elsa. Calm down. It's a lot. Here. Gotta find him, Mike. Aw, oh, Mike's on it. He's a good brother. Is he being followed? Come on, Mike, outrun them. Lose him, Mike! Is he gonna find him? I'm worried about him! <gasps> he looks awful! How did he end up there? Is he okay? Hide him, hide him, hide him! Mom, remember the goblin? I swear, the most excellent promise you can make. They need your help. That's terrific. She thought it was a toy. I think we're dying. Oh. What's she gonna do? She's gonna freak out. Oh, is the mom gonna tell on them? It's the cops. Oh, crap. God. That is so creepy! Could have at least knocked on the door and told them what's going on. Why do they do that so creepily? I don't want these guys to get E.T. What are they gonna do to him? What the heck is that? This is so creepy. Holy, they put all that over the house? I don't think they're gonna be nice to him. It's that same guy with the keys from the very beginning. What do they want with him? This is crazy. I mean, I guess this is what they probably would do if they heard an alien, an actual alien was somewhere. Who are you? Who are you? It's the first time we've seen his face. What's the matter with Elliot? Did it ever yes. build anything? No. Don't tell him. Ability to manipulate its own Don't tell him. He communicates through Elliot. Elliot feels his feelings. I don't know if you should tell them that they're gonna take Elliot too. The synchronization of brainwave activity between both subjects. Uh, 
I think you get more information with the Swan Gang. Oxygen saturation is 82 percent. Oh, this poor kid. I'm alone, but I can take care of him. He doesn't look good. It could be sepsis. He's dying. I've been to the forest. That machine. It's doing something. Maybe the aliens will come save him. He came to me. He came to me too. I've been wishing oh, we did it. since I was ten. I don't want him to die. Is that what true? He's calling his people. I don't think he was left here intentionally. Yeah, they accidentally leader. left him. It's a miracle. You did the best that anybody could. I'm glad he met you first. Is this kid gonna die? He doesn't have four nucleotides like we do. He has six. I've got two brainwave activity. What are they? E.T. The voice condition is stabilizing. He's, he's unlinking from him. Oh, yeah. Oh. He's talking. Stay with me. Stay together. I think he might die. Stay. He's gonna die. His pressure is bottoming out. They're separating. Yes. The boy's coming back. We're losing the team. Everything's going to be fine. He's gonna die. He died. I think he died. You can't get a pulse of blood pressure. Do it. What's the child doing? CPR. No femoral pulse. Okay, let's go CPR. Come on, let's go. Oh my goodness. Did he die? Back him in ice. He's dead. He didn't get to go home. We wish we had to go back. I wish. I wish too. <sighs> Wait for Elliot. Would you just like to spend some time alone with him? Well, this guy seems nice we enough. Step out for a minute, please. I can't believe he died. I'm so sorry. You tried, little I man. I can't feel anything anymore. I don't believe in you all my life. Every day. Oh, goodness. I love you. His heart, his heart. He's alive, he's alive, he's alive. Oh my gosh. He did home. Get him out of there. Get him out of there. Oh. E.T. phone home. Shut up now. E.T. phone home. E.T. phone home. How's he gonna get him out of there? No! No! How are they gonna get him out of there? I'm supposed to give you this note when they're gone. Give it to me now, Gertie. Oh my god. Who are you? I'm driving. <laughs> Open the door, son. Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Punch it! I'm never feeling full and... <laughs> Meet us at the playground at the top of the hill. Yeah, we need more kids with bikes in the mix. All right. We're all gonna die and they're never gonna give me my license. Oh. Where's the playground? I don't know, streets! Mom always drives! Cut them loose. He's alive. Where are you going? Spaceship. Spaceship. <laughs> that kid knows everything that's going on. They should listen to her. Oh man, all the cops. I guess these kids don't even know what it is. Yeah. We're taking him to a spaceship. Can he just beam up? This is reality, Greg. Come on, Greg. Don't be an idiot. This is sweet. Come on, fellas. We cut the kids off at the bottom of the hill. Oh, God. Sweet. Right on top of the car. Come on, come on, come on. You guys can make it. Let's split up. Good thinking. This is the one time I do want people to split up. 
Yeah. He should just make them fly. Oh boy. Not yet, boys. Oh, they're not gonna shoot him. Yeah. Awesome. He made them fly! Tell me when it's over! So sweet. Great music. Those kids are the coolest. Yay! He's so happy. He's so happy. See, this kid knows everything. I just wanted to say goodbye. There's no goodbye. Be good. Look at the other little guy. You. Best friends through all the universe. Come. He can't come. Ouch. Ouch. He has to go now. I'll be right here. <gasps> Harvey. I'm so happy for you, Chi. Goodness, he got to go home. <sighs> okay, guys, well, that was E.T., and I really liked that one. I feel like I should have watched it in childhood. It had a nostalgia feel to it. I just really liked it. It was so good. Heartwarming, and the bond between E.T. and Elliot was so sweet. I thought all the kids were really good. They were really solid actors, especially the main kid, Elliot. Man, that kid is good. I was failing him when he was crying. I was just like, <laughs> God, please don't catch E.T. Like, I don't want him to die. Like, it was really heartwarming and, and very sweet. I'm so glad that E.T. didn't die and he got to go home. That really made me happy. I'm gonna give the MVP to both Elliot and E.T. together. They are linked, they are BFFs, they are meant to be soulmates, linked through all space and time, I believe best friends so i just really i love them as a duo they had such a sweet sweet bond i just love them so they both get my mvp loki mvp i'm gonna give to the big brother michael he did save et he fished him out of that river and and saved him so i think we owe a lot to big brother michael he was a good big brother i think he definitely deserves the loki mvp the worst i'm just gonna give to any of those lab guys that were trying to catch et and presumably do experiments on him and do terrible things instead of just letting him go and letting him go home those guys are definitely the worst this was such a good one it just feels like one i would have loved as a child and i think the music too really makes it feel nostalgic something about that feels so nostalgic and riding bikes and backpacks and just all of it felt felt really nostalgic for me so i really loved it and thank you guys so much for watching along with me today i really appreciate it i had a great time i hope you had a great time too and i will see you next time. Bye guys.